So it's finally time for me. It's me. Good morning, good afternoon, good night. It's me, Jabba. Today we're gonna watch the girl I like forget her glasses. Finally, and since reading the manga, I I have been you know waiting anticipating because I think it is one of the mangas that deserve an anime adaptation because I know there's a demand for the manga and now there here we here we are. I I think it's somewhat popular right now. I don't know how it will fare out in the long run, but I'm expecting good things because the read was nice. Reading it was nice, especially around the latest chapters. Around the time, one of three was the latest chapter as of time recording this. But around the latest chapters, more, maybe twenty, twenty uh, chapter eighty after. Those were really nice, <laughs> the other ones. But the, the journey before that is also fun and entertaining. And I just want to see how they're gonna do with the anime adaptation because it's gonna be different. When reading the manga, I feel like there has there has to be some changes need to be done in order for the manga timeline to fit or to create a nice atmosphere timeline for the anime. So it's just devil and shall we? And we're gonna. Go with the next scene and do what I do with new animates while watching the first episodes. Episode one of the girl I like forget the glasses and that's what I'm gonna call it. Let's dive in, shall we? And let's go to Andes first. Here we are. This watch Pokemon Horizons, and then let's just go scroll below. I'm more of a manga reader, by the way. Here we are. The girl I like releasing. Oh, it's eight episodes already. So let's just go watch. Set this to watch, and then set it to episode one. There we go. First episode. Let's just watch it now. You know, I'm honestly shocked that it has this much color. It's so vibrant, has so many details compared to the earlier one, or compared to the my side first time. So many frames I see and so many different attacks or approaches for it. Who's? Wait, wait, what? Wait. Two Mandy. Those are not in the manga. He sounds like a high schooler. They're in middle school. I'm honestly expecting Mia's hair to be more pink than that. Yeah. What studio did this? Which which studio is in charge of this one? これはその子のことか。俺はその子のことか。Wait. Wait, 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 wait. I don't wanna say something right now. I don't wanna say something now. Because this could be a 
first episode thing. Wait, uh, which studio did it again? I could just check later. But so far, those scouts look somewhat realistic. It's either they're good or it's... It's, I think, what I think it is. What happened? What just connected and disconnected? And disconnected and connected. You know, honestly, I'm expecting her to be more pink. But it's. When can I actually hear her talk? First of all, I'm not complaining about the quality of the image because that alone is good. That alone is outstanding. The visuals are outstanding. But... Why <laughs> Kinda sounds too mighty. It doesn't sound like a middle schooler like Nishigata does. Like what? Like what? Kaji Yuki did. Why Nishigata? ね、月悪いと思うけど、気にしないでね。見えにくいから目に力が入ってるだけ。え今日ちょっと目がね、忘れちゃって。初めて話せた。わ、忘れたの。だからちゃんと見えなくて、ちゃんと見えないのに、そ
which was a good but the animation feels like it's anime anime drawing plus cgi plus real life images turned cartoony all three in one and it feels weird and it's because probably i don't really watch anime that often so i don't know much but the, the ones that I do watch are the more old and traditional, the usual and the old ones. I mostly read, mostly watched. The anime that I have watched most are from 2009 to 2014. If my analyst, if I remember with the analyst, my analyst is correct. <laughs> Isn't that a real video? Isn't that a real video? Of a, of a forest? It's... I know... I know some anime and cartoons have done those before, but it feels weird in the modern times. It feels weird in 2023. <laughs> Weird. It's it's gorgeously weird. And they're rendered. I feel like those are rendered. About me, son's voice. I feel like they could have been more expressionate. I'm honestly expecting her to be a bit more expressionate, even with even with the with the facial expression, those kinds of facial expressions. I was more more expression on her voice, more more expression, more tonality. <laughs> あ。どうした大丈夫。<laughs> I knew it. I knew what's gonna happen, but I, but I vaguely for I, I suddenly kind of forgot it for a short while, and then <laughs> oh, the execution is just funny. You know what? I think it's time for me to say it. 
Nissan's voice is not what I expected. It's fine. <coughs> <laughs> you know the ideal voice for me, son. I haven't watched much of the anime in question, but Toradora. Taiga, Taiga, Toradora. Me, they should have. Was I right? Was I right with the main character? The female main character? I know it's Taiga, but I need to double check. <laughs> I think I should check animes later because I have a hunch that I have a hunch that I have a hunch that the one that voiced Komura is the same one for Tadanos or Dora. Aisaka Taiga. I feel like she would be the best choice by the voice, in my opinion. The way. The way. The way Tiger speaks, that kind of voice. Anime list. Nope, I'm wrong. But there's some they some similarities so that's why i get the idea なんで<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> 
I forgot the old job. Yeah, that's the probable thing. I think I remember that it happened that way, so. I think Minisan gets scolded in here later on because there's gonna be a there's a mistake that there's a mistake that's gonna happen. Yep. <笑>まあ、
、どんな顔してたんだ。<笑>次回よく来るしますこの俺の And it's done well, but there are a lot of questionable things that I don't know if I like those choices that much. I'm not a, an anime expert, it's not my domain. I don't watch that much anime, I don't really dive deep into the studios. I know some studios, or maybe some studios matter in choosing, but. I don't really dive myself that deep. I know my manga though.、Uh, at least I know some manga though. But I don't know about the anime.、Uh, for this one, it's good. I like it. It's nice. It's so nice. But some choices between like CGI plus real life turning into part. To me, as goings, and then you know, you know, you know, those things on Chowder, and it's, it's just and CGI and rendered the voice acting is fine, it could have been better, but it's fine. I mean, I'm not gonna blame much for voice acting, but I wish they could just. Yeah, no. Pick people with. That suit. That pick voices that suit better. I'm not gonna blame the actors and actresses on this one. It's more on the studio for not picking the right voice. It's just, they're just doing their job, so. I'm not. They're not to blame. Like with Urushi. But overall, I like it. I wish there could have been some things that are different. But I like it nonetheless. It's weird, but it's gorgeously weird. So that's it for today. See you on the next episode. Love you all.